Hey guys, how's it going? This is Anthony and today I'm going to be doing another video where I drive over to the supercharger. We're going to be doing another supercharging test because in my last video I made a few mistakes. One of them being I parked next to another Tesla. So my supercharger, the charging speed was being shared with his and it was cutting the charging time in half. So I didn't give you guys an accurate reading on how fast it is. Also, my battery was at like 150 miles or something like that. So it was at a a six like a 60% charge or something like that so it wasn't charging as fast as it should have been now when I head there now uh, it has six of the eight stalls available that's that might change by the time I get there but I'm hoping it doesn't so I can park by myself I can plug the car in and we can get an accurate reading on how fast the supercharging is so let's head over to the supercharger Also, someone commented on my previous video, how is it like navigating on the partial premium Model 3? And, you know, it's not any different than any other Tesla. You know, yes, you only have the uh, GPS maps, but that's fine. All you have to do is hit navigate, and you put where you want to go. So if I put uh, super, the first thing that pops up is a supercharger in Pinellas Park. That's the one I want to go to, so all I do is I click it. And it gives me a route, and that's that's my route and everything. So yeah, it's not you know it's not hard. It's a it's a very easy process, and the navigation begins. So that's just something really quick I wanted to show you guys. So we parked the car and my battery is at 50 miles left on the battery. So we're gonna plug in the supercharger and see how fast it is. I'm just gonna grab the supercharger. Yeah. Open it up. Plug that in. And it is blue. It is blue. There it goes, it is now green. So let's go check the charging speed. It looks like that might be the peak. That might be the fastest it'll charge. Oh, it's debating between 101 and 102 kilowatts. It says time remaining to me for me to get a 90% charge is about 50 minutes. And yeah, so okay. So 100, 101, 102 kilowatts. 462 to 463 miles an hour and so far I have received five miles of range just by sitting here so that's pretty insane that's actually really insane alrighty guys so I'm gonna let this uh, charge up and I will get back to you also guys on a side note I have installed wireless chargers into the Model 3 these only cost me about $60 on Amazon so if you guys are interested in wireless charging this is a 10 watt wireless charger, so it'll charge the iPhones to the 7.5 watts, and I believe the Androids to the 9 watts. I think they charge a little bit faster wirelessly, some of them. But anyways, this will, you know, it'll charge it up as fast as possible. So if you guys are interested in this, I will put a link in the description below. Alrighty guys, so I finished my supercharging. I only charged up to 50% because 
I really don't need any more than that right now. My total was 459, and as you saw, I was getting around like 400 and uh, something miles an hour. So it was pretty good, you know. It has some really decent speeds. But for now, I'm going to head back to the house and call it a day.